All right, you all. So here we are at Negra Everett's home. It's the National Mississippi Freedom Trail. So this is legit still in the middle of a neighborhood, so it's pretty crazy. Hey, how you doing? Now, if you want a full breakdown and overview of what took place during this terrible tragedy, which is now known as the death site of Mega Evers, there's plenty of news reports and just documentaries and movies about it um, that are probably a lot more qualified to speak on than I am. So that's not what this is going to be about. But this is his home as of now. Um, so it is a national site, as you saw. Um, and it is easily accessible. It's not like tickets or anything. It's not like an attraction. It's, again, it's basically a memorial for someone that was killed. Um, but it is in a functioning neighborhood. As you all heard, someone walked up to me. Some kids were staying out at school and stuff like that. Um, as you can see, a site of a tragedy. Um, so long story short, he was killed while in his home. He tried to walk out to his driveway, ended up dying in his driveway. And the guy that shot him bragged about it. And so, I mean, everything kind of stood still after that and so this is his house right here and just some facts about it now i couldn't go inside as you can see um i don't know if they have like tours or whatever you want to call them to go inside but i just randomly stopped by so that wasn't the case here but it was just surreal to be here um it's terrible um of course you can't go inside now because it's closed not to mention it's early in the morning it's like six in the morning y'all but I got other places to go. Just want to get this real quick. So this is extremely important, y'all. This is just, this is depressing. I'm just so fed up, y'all. Oh, wow. Okay, so I was wrong. He... So it went through a window. I thought he died in the parking lot, but it was in the window. Oh my goodness. If you're still here, thank you for watching. There is one last thing I do want to mention. If you have not yet seen my solo documentary about going on the civil rights trail, I highly recommend that you check it out. I'll go ahead and put a link in the description of this video so you can check it out. Probably some cards as well. Uh, but it was a really good trip. It was a very emotional and powerful trip, but I learned a lot, and this is a part of it. Hope to see you there. Peace out.